What is going on guys? Um, it's gonna be a different kind of video today. I got, I moved the baby rabbits into the grow up pen. So that got done. There's a bunch of stuff I need to get picked in the garden. So I'm gonna bring you along and see that. Kind of the first picking of the garden so far this year. Check up on the garden, see the meat rabbits, and also show you a cage I got for free today. A uh, rabbit cage. Actually, I'm gonna be using it for a quail cage. So, so it begins the quail adventure on this channel. All right guys, let's get to it. And when you don't have a proper gardening basket, you just use a leftover Easter basket from one of your kids. All right, this plant here, a pepper plant, banana peppers, it is, you can see it's tipping over, it's so overloaded. And the next thing is this zucchini. I didn't even see this one. Hold the basket up, buddy. I didn't even think I planted cucumbers, but I must have. Pretty sure I didn't this year. Unless there's a volunteer from last year. Pretty cool. Oh, I don't know what happened to my zucchini plant here. Oh, here's another giant one. Another one. Oh my. You guys can see the onions are still doing pretty well. Still growing. You can see it's right, right there getting to be a bit of a bulb. So that's good. And then you can see all of our squash. These are spaghetti squash. And there's acorns mixed in here. There's a big spaghetti squash. There's some more. It's getting to be a real jungle. And then in here, there's the pumpkin, there's the pumpkin right there, pumpkin plant. It's pretty cool. Our winter squash is growing good. And definitely, Definitely next year I'll be making more space, a bigger garden, because this is really overgrown. Alright, that's what I was looking for. Two jalapenos here. Let's go check the tomato plants. There's no ripe tomatoes yet but they're getting there i can see there's a bunch on this plant some there a bunch here so none ripe yet but there's gonna be for sure now here are the other tomato plants that my heirlooms are mixed in here as you can see there's some blossoms but no fruit yet these ones are just a little behind the others but they'll get there so here's what we got out of the first picking. Two jalapenos, some banana peppers, which these are gonna get, uh, I think pickled. I don't know, we'll see. Zucchini, and then cucumber plants I didn't know I planted, or they're from last year, one of the two. All right guys, and here is what I got for free today. I was, I seen these sitting along the road a few days ago. There's three of them, and there's only one left when I went back today. 
But, uh, so I went back today with my friend who had a truck. Got these. Or it's like sturdy. It's sturdy wire. You can see it's missing a leg, but that's no big deal. I'll just put, I'm going to cut the leg here and get one put back on. But yeah, these are either going to be for quail, and they could be grow-out cages for rabbits too. I'm not sure which I'm going to do yet, but pretty cool. I didn't even see that. A little latch that catches when you flip it up. And then I got this one as well. It's just an old dog kennel that, like I've done, lined it with wire. Well, that's pretty cool. And then I got this tray of feeders slash waterers. So, for the price of free, you can't beat that. But alright guys, I'm going to get the leg put on this, and then that's probably going to be the end of this video. It's just kind of a random, I knew there's stuff I need to pick in the garden. And, uh, I want to show you the plants, the progress they're making, and these free cages. So, all right, guys. Just like new, for the price of free, can't beat that. Just like new, price of free, can't beat it. And here are the grow outs that I moved to this grow out cage. These were from my dough butterscotch that were in here. They were born June 1st, so they're, it was time for them to be separated from mom. I'm keeping just this one here, brown, as a breeder. The rest of these are going to be bound for freezer camp. Here are these guys. And here are these guys. These, they were little, little last time I showed you. They get big in a hurry. There's four here. There's mom. One on top of mom and one behind her. But, yeah, you get big in a hurry. And then here's the breeder from the last litter I butchered. This is the one I kept. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed. Um, we'll catch you later.